Hey, what's going on, Trab? It's Red again. I thought, fuck it, why not? Let me hit you guys up with another reading as well. This reading's um, more for the light workers, you know, the people that's holding the light right now. You know, the conspiracy theorists, <laughs> as they call it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be giving you a reading, and it's with the Arch- Archangel um, Oracle cards. Um, so yeah. It's a general reading anyway, um, through all the star signs, but no, um, yeah, it could be through the star signs, but it's just a reading for, um, yeah, for us light workers right now, um, to see where we're at, where we're, where we, where we are at, Jesus, all right, so what signs, what insight does the universe want to give? us right now for these crazy times that we're in this spiritual warfare and all that yeah it's all mad all right so the first card that popped out gang is all is well so yeah everything is as it should be for us right now guys and the card says everything is happening exactly as it is supposed to with hidden blessings you will soon understand so yeah guys everything's going exactly how it should be um it's funny how all is well is the card that come out right like the first card for for us lot um yeah so even though the world's all chaotic and there's a lot of um yeah a lot of madness that's going on right about now vaccines and yeah it's all dense energy right now and yeah everyone's feeling a bit at unease right now but everything is how it should be so just take care of yourself and rest and um yeah the story's playing out exactly how it as it should be man and all is well and then the second card that popped out was prosperity Your material needs are provided as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. So everyone can manifest. It's not hard. You just need to know what you want to manifest. So if you've been thinking about starting up your own business or whatever, um, you have to set your intentions, write it down and then take action. Um, But this also means that we're um, spiritually like abundant as well. yeah because there's ways of making money and um it's not just about money but um to think outside the box maybe like you know some people like kind of caught in the system with the nine to five stuff and a lot of people going self-employed and working outside the box even though um pubs and all that they're getting affected right now but um yeah other businesses are coming off the ground um right about now or maybe you just start your own business and become self-employed i'm just going to give it another shuffle guys because i love shuffling but yeah there are two two awesome cards that come out straight away so there's nothing to worry about guys everything is how it should be and let's keep going and we've got divine order once again so that's basically saying everything is how it should be everything is how it needs to be right now look past the illusion and see underlying order so even though it's all chaotic right now um collectively a lot of people are in fear right now and that's kind of dense energy should i say and a lot of people are stuck in that but because the energy of the earth is ascending um it's going to keep them in that fear state for a while and then they'll realize and start waking up and the energy will get less dense but that's going to take a while guys we're just in it we've just begun so um everything is how it should be and you just need to work on yourself and elevate your vibration because the more you elevate they elevate should i say <laughs> All right, let me just get it all out. Um, okay, next we got 
is victory. So your prayers have been heard and answered. Have faith. So the the way things are looking right now is looking quite chaotic and all mad and stuff. But there's the foundations are crumbling and yeah if the foundations ain't strong or built on lies should i say um they will eventually come down anyway it might take hundreds of years or whatever but it's already begun so the victory it's already won should i say but it takes a while to materialize should i say but yeah have faith things are working out guys and your prayers have been heard um and they'll be answered just have faith and they 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 will be taken care of should i say and then next guys we've got um relationship harmony um so that's we angels are opening the hearts of everyone involved arguments and conflicts are being resolved now so that might mean all kind of relationships um that you're going through to just basically see them come from a place of love so i don't know um meeting the bus driver if he stopped and he said said i'll have a good day or something that's like a relationship in its own way so if you come from a place of love to all the relationships they will all flourish even if they're not meant for you or whatever in all aspects should i say and it also might mean um all the relationships oh actually wait hold on i'll get two you might have keep your um this is two scenarios you might this is a sign either to keep your circle small because the more smaller your circle is the more harmonious it is because you ain't got a lot of chaos going around and it also might mean um that relationships around you are starting to harmonize if you've been having arguments in your family or whatnot um so yeah everything's kind of being taken care of once again should i say yeah things will be in harmonious and um your next card our next card is um gifts from god and then the card says, we angels bring you gifts from your creator. Open your arms to receive. So, um, the universe um, always sends you gifts. Um, when you pay attention to the small gifts, um, the big, bigger gifts start to manifest and come towards you. Um, and it's like, I don't know, if you find 20p on the floor, if you're grateful for that 20p, next week you might find a pound or whatever like the universe multiplies it's so weird um and this is also saying be open to receive because if um healers like to give a lot and don't like to receive but it's a time to learn to receive um so if you're not open to receive you're stopping your own blessings from coming in the universe is trying to send you gifts but you don't want the gifts and then you're getting vexed at the universe for not providing you but it is providing you you just don't want it should i say <laughs> and then next we've got creative writing so that might let me just read the card for starters um make time to write down your thoughts in a journal or pen an article or book so that might be um to start a vision board guys what i get from that um because i've been working on mine but um, that's also creative writing and it's setting goals and discipline as well, if that makes sense. So you've got something to kind of um, them little goals to make you evolve and to raise your vibration. I don't know, um, to meditate for five minutes every day or something. Yeah. Or to write out your thoughts and feelings about how you're going, what you're going through right now. And then you can look back over it to see what lessons you was dealing with or are dealing with and to plan for the future or whatever yeah it's all just bloody flowing out right now but yeah some creative writing guys if you've if you write um lyrics sing rap mc um yeah get it's time to do some self-expression so some creative writing guys and then what's that clear 
Okay, and then our next card it our next card Clod Clod Taraz Clod <laughs> Um our next card is Clear Sentience, I think. I ain't seen this card in ages. But um notice your recurring physical and emotional feelings as they are it's sorry one second. Symphony Sign Sinfinity, what the shit is that? Sign Signifity or whatever the fuck that is. Um divine guidance. Okay, so if you've been having um getting reoccurring physical or emotional um things that come up for you right now, they're basically um things that you should be uh working on in a way. So if you've got um your feet are hurting or um, you're having leg problems that means you need to get kind of grounded so go out into nature and um, get grounded um, if you've been having any I don't know upper back problems like you feel like you're carrying the world on your sh shoulders or whatever um, that kind of means you need to work on your throat chakra or your heart chakra so yeah check them things out if you've been um, google the what's it called spiritual meaning for certain pains and it will show you to wherever you're at um, or wh wherever needs healing, should I say? Um, okay, what's that say? Okay, and then our next card is um, clear audience. Notice the loving guidance you hear inside your mind or from other people. So it's quite a magical time right about now, um, during the ascension, should I say, because. Um, uh because the energy is rising if you're like an empath or um do work with energy should i say um because the energy is rising our consciousness is rising and the vibration is rising so you start your superpowers should i say will start to unlock so if you've been hanging around with i don't know your close friends or whatever because you vibrate at a certain level you can basically start reading each other's thoughts and knowing what they're going to say and that's going to be um, happening quite frequently and that's one of your superpowers basically unlocking right about now um, because, you know, if you hang around with like-minded people um, and you're all on the same vibration, should I say, um, it's like, you know, your best friend. If, when you don't some sentences you're you can finish for your best friend kind of thing and that's going to be happening more and more um which i noticed already is happening so um yeah that's pretty cool um but yeah as long as it's coming from a place of a loving place that's a good thing if you're getting your intuition going but if it's coming from a bad place then yeah you don't want that crap but yeah let me just give you an overall looking at the cards I've done it some messed up way, like the way I recorded this one. So, um, yeah, I'll just let you guys look at them for a minute. But our centre card is um, Relationship Harmony. So, that's our main card. And everything is going to kind of evolve out of um, this Relationship Harmony. So, if you're at peace with yourself, everything else will kind of just fall into place, guys. But um, yeah, that's your reading anyway. That's for the light workers and um, people whose consciousness is expanding. And for those whose consciousness has just awakened, should I say, fuck it. Um, but yeah, man, that's your reading, guys. But um, yeah, man, if you guys like the video, man, you guys know what to do. Peace, love and light, guys. Have a good week anyway.